This guy just chased Skylar into the house. She was walking into the door. And... I don't want to hold the door. Oh, it tickles. Where, why, where are you going, dude? Why are you going up to... I don't want you going up to my face. <laughs> He's on my phone right now, but... Um, he was chasing Skylar in the house. She walked in and he was like... Beep, 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 right after her. Now he's just standing there looking at me. He's right there. think so but there's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven at least eleven buzzards vultures in the backyard right now that's crazy they're still there right there they don't seem to care that I'm here So I thought they all just flew like over there. But I turn around and like six or so more just flew up right behind me. Whoa, and there's some in the trees over there. And they're all in that tree there and on that house. They're everywhere. I've never seen anything like this. I'm out here in the garage and today I'm working on some Halloween stuff I guess technically. Give me a second. Halloween's almost here which means that I need to come up with a new concept for the Houston zombie walk and I think I have a pretty good one this year. And let me move all this stuff out of the way and I'll show you what we're gonna be doing today. Side of me. I got a box full of faces basically right here in my garage. That one was really cool. Check out this video right over here and uh, you can see it in motion. It's so cool. So what are we doing? We're working on some Halloween stuff. We're getting started. The stage one. About a year or so ago, uh, I started this. 
this is a hard shell that encases the silicone. And inside, we have a mold of my head and a little bit of my shoulders. So um, I'm going to finally pour the plaster piece inside here. See? Okay, this is Hydrocal White in the brown bag. Here's the mold, here's a bucket for water. All we do is mix the, the Hydrocal White with water, slosh it up, pour it in here, let it dry. Hopefully, this will work. I haven't been messing with this stuff. My life's been so up and down over the last year. I haven't been doing very many special effects things. But, I have to get back into it. It is, it is Halloween month. If you guys want to see more art stuff, just let me know and I'll start doing a speed video of either me tattooing or airbrushing or doing some special effects stuff, makeup, whatever. And I'll start posting those hopefully once a week on top of the once a week vlogs. You want to sift it as you go through it like this. Break up any clumps. You want it to sort of soak up into the top and look sort of like a dried up lake. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need to add some more. You gotta get all these clumps out. This is part of the reason you sift it in there. I always wear crappy clothes when you do this. In case you're wondering, it sort of feels pretty awesome. When it starts hardening, it gets really, really hot. Well, I might luck out, it might be enough. Hell yeah. You wanna know what I'm doing to get this shot for you guys? That's what I'm doing. I feel like a moron, but hopefully this shot works out for you. It's a good way to stretch. All right, let's see how this thing came out. Mold came out so so. Well, actually, the casting came out so so. Oh, this thing's still hot. I should have waited longer, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank God I don't have all these things on my head for real. Jeez, that would be gross. But is that really what I look like? Is my nose that crooked? Psh, wrong keys. Different car. Run to the bank real quick and drop off some cash. I got the first of the month, it's time to pay some bills. You got the phone bills, the car bills, the insurance bills, the uh, rent bills, the electric bills. You got bills. We don't ever get sunsets that look like that in Houston, or very rarely. I think that will wrap up our day. And she's always mad because she looks unmade up when I film her, but I don't care. Hey, hey. Cause baby you're a pooey fish. Cause baby